Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Amen. 9.2. Question number 6. Uh, 2. Okay. 62. Log A base A B. Left hand side. Equal to log A base A B into log A base A by B. In the similar manner, <coughs> BC and C, okay. So, in two of us, I'm going to put the body. Log A plus. Okay. At a three number, no? Ah, two number. Log A A plus. Log A B. In two tackle, plus for a little bit. And division tackle, give a little bit. Cut out thick if I lift out, okay? I'm gonna lift this in a tournament idea for you, okay? So, a can is echo log k, it is the a horror log b, it is the b horror, a plus b into a minus b. A plus b into a minus b, the kitchen formula? A square minus b square. Very good. So, a square minus b square. Prothom to take a it as b. Then a can you a plus b into a minus b. A can you take a a square minus b square. Then third tackle to the expand for a tile a square minus b square as b. Even the other is a category to the day. It is a money can lock a b whole square, lock a b whole square plus minus. So they will be cancelled. So, the key of the four is the third touch of a link, but of a link by the shop to look at a category and ultimately it will become zero. Understood? Look, John, are you? Okay, so now let us take a look at number three. I'm a shop to look at him to the end so that to make an idea of house and back with the button is the full of the world. So number three, log root over a. Okay, uh, I guess put it this way. Left hand side, root a base b. About the plus sign into. This is equal to eight. We have to prove. So what we can do? B can be written as root B whole square. Log root B. C can be written as root C whole square into log root C root A whole square. Now this power can be written here. We know two log root a base root b 2 2 log root b base root c into 2 log root c base root a by the way i can tell you i'm right i have six lam the root b root c karagati root c root c karagati to tell you root a base root a because of it direct and 2 into 2 into 2 it will be 8 
Number four, log A base, okay. This is our left hand side, okay? Don't forget to light, right? Left hand side is equal to now log A. Log A. Then here, these are power, right? A to the power this thing. So this one can be written here. So A, A, B. A to the power, A to the power B. This can be written here. So this will become log a base a power take a gallicle can log a base a base a then again log a base is a a rupor is a power this power can be written before this log so i can write a to the power b then it will become this one this part will become log a base a and log a base a this one is one so this can be written into one so then again uh, a to the power b this is power so power can be written here so i will write b log this will become a base a a base a and log a base a this will also become one like into one is <coughs> the same thing right so again b into log a base a is one into one so it will be b only that is equal to right hand side so we are done with number six Anybody have any doubt? No, sir. Okay, very good. Simple, right? Just power bula aage aage likhte thay ba. Easy. Okay. I think we can go back to example. Till example twenty six, I gave you homework. So within example 26, do you have any doubt? Sir, in example 25. Example 25. Okay. Yes. This one says show that log x to the power log a base y is equal to y to the power log a base x. Now uh, they have considered this one as p and other one as q. A base y and a base x. Okay. Now a to the power p is equal to y, it is okay is equal to x. Okay. Then both sides they have power q. So a to the power p q again is a p q. Oh okay. So let's do this x to the power log a base y. Um what we have to show, that one I will write here, x to the power log a base y is equal to, I guess, y to the power log a base x. Okay, so the first one that we have as power, we will consider this one, let log a base y, we have considered this one as p and the power on right hand side we consider that one log a base x as q okay now if you remember from here i can write one thing a to the power p is equal to y you remember i showed you this circle thing a to the power p can be written is equal to y and following the same method a to the power q is equal to x a to the power q is equal to x now a to the power p, if I take q as power on both the sides, I can do this. 
a to the power t is already there q i have taken as power so q i have to take power on this side also so i can write a to the power p q is equal to y to the power q then here also a to the power q whole to the power p we will take okay so x to the power p then here we get a to the power p q is equal to x to the power p now you can see that if you compare equation one and equation two, okay, y to the power q, it is equal to a to the power pq, x to the power p, this is also equal to a to the power pq. So I can write y to the power q is equal to x to the power p, right? So we can write comparing equation one and two, we can write x to the power p is equal to y to the power q. So x to the power p, what is p? p is equal to log a base y, so x to the power log a base y is equal to y to the power q, what is q? log a base x, log a base x. So this is what we had to prove, left hand side equal to right hand side. Anyone has any doubt? This one has written. So till example 26, you don't have any problem then? No. Nobody? Confirm? Yes, sir. Okay. So we can take a look at example 27. Example 27, we can see that there is a left hand side and we have to prove that is equal to one. Okay, let us see how we can do that. I will write the question on the board first. Okay. So if you see, if you take a look at the left hand side, then you can see that in the denominator, we have log A base ABC. Then in the second denominator, we have log B base ABC. And in the third denominator, we have log C base ABC. So we can consider these equal to X, Y, Z, okay? This is example 27, example 27. So we have considered, we have considered the first denominator that is log A base ABC log a base a b c is equal to is x and log the second denominator log a base b base a b c is equal to y and log c base a b c is equal to z now from here what we can write a to the power x is equal to a b c must remember this arrow I am showing you for your understanding. You don't have to give this arrow in the answer paper. If you give this arrow, then there might be some mark deduction, okay? A to the power x is equal to abc. Then b to the power y is equal to abc. And c to the power z is equal to abc. Then from here, what we can write, a is equal to abc. A, B, C, whole to the power 1 by X, right? Because X, if I change the power, then it will be uh, 1 by X. Similarly, B will be equal to A, B, C, whole to the power 1 by Y. And C is equal to A, B, C, whole to the power 1 by Z. Okay? Now, from here, what we can write? A into B into C. Okay? It is equal to uh, you know, here we can write a, b, c to the power 1, right? But here I will put the value of a. What is the value of a? The value of a, we have got a, b, c whole to the power 1 by x into b. What is the value of b? a, b, c whole to the power y. a, b, c whole to the power 1 by y, sorry. And a, b, c to the power 1 by z. That is the value of c. Then this one, I have taken under one bracket, I can do that. And as there is no power written, so we can consider power one. As the bases are same and there is into between them, we can write the power as addition, right? The power will be added one by X plus one by Y plus one by Z. Now you can see that on both the side, the base is equal. So the power can be written equal. Okay, the base is same, so the power can be written equal. One is equal to one by x plus one by y plus one by z. 
So our work is almost done. We just need to replace the value of x. What we considered is log a base abc. Okay, so from here what we can replace the value of x log a base abc <clears throat> plus then one by y. Y is b base abc. Plus one by log C base ABC. Is equal to where I put all the values? That is equal to one. It is equal to one. This is what they have told us to prove. So left hand side is equal to right hand side. Anybody have any doubt? Is it clear? This type yes. of uh you know this might seem very puzzling if you try to solve them for the first time in the example okay but when you practice at home these problems will become easier to solve in the exam okay so please practice more and more at home okay then we have the next example example 28 okay i believe you should be able to do example 28 and 29 as well Okay, so I will give you a couple of minutes time to take a look at it. And if you come across any doubt that in a particular line that you're not understanding what they did, then you may ask me, okay? I will be waiting. So everyone, please come to page number 222 and 223. Take a look at example 28 and 29 and let me know if you have any doubt. If there is doubt, then inshallah we will discuss. So you have doubt in the first line of example 28. Yeah, okay, I will show you. <clears throat> you know, these are the tricks that, uh, you know, generally doesn't come to our mind, okay, when we are solving on our own. That's why this type of problems need to be practiced again and again. Even though if you practice once or twice only, in the exam hall, whenever you will see the question, you will feel like, okay, this question is very familiar to me, but uh, uh, something I had to do here, what was that? You can't recall okay that happens to many of the students that happened to me for so many times so that is why you have to practice you know five six times okay so here uh, it is given in the question that p is equal to uh, log a base bc p is equal to log a base bc now if you take a look at the uh, you know the left hand side in left hand side, what they've told one by one plus p or p plus one, okay, p plus one. And then you have got one by, you know, other things, q plus one and r plus one. I will just explain this part so that you can uh, get an idea about the next part. So we have the value of p here, but we need the value of p plus one. So what we can do, we can add one on both the side, correct? I have added one on both the side. Now, uh, <clears throat> one plus p, this one, this one, I, if I want, I can write as a base a, correct or not? A base a, if the base and this one is same, then it is one. So I will take the advantage of this one and I will write a base a. Now you might ask me, sir, why did you write a base a? You could have written b base b, c base c, because here we have a base, right? Log a base b, c. Now, as the base is same and there is plus in between so we can write it as a multiplication log a base a into bc so it will be abc so we have a value of one plus p in the similar manner you will get the value of one plus q as log you know there will be log b base b, uh, b base ac i guess so it will be log b base p you have to take in case of q so it will be log b base abc and one plus r, it will be equal to log c base abc. Okay, so in this process, you will get these two lines also. And you, when you put the value, inshallah, you will get your answer. Clear? Yes. So in, in example 29, the third number line. Okay. Third line says that. Oh, it is just simply multiplication. They found out the value of log A, log B, and log C, right? 
Then in third line, what they did, they have written x log a. So whatever the value you got for log a, you have to multiply x with it, okay? Let me show you a part and just on the part, inshallah you will understand. So example 29, they have got the value of log a as a into y minus z. Mm. Log a is equal to k into y minus z. Okay, then they got the value of, not sorry, base it is here. Okay, if you write it here, then it shows base, but it's not base, okay? So log A is equal to K into Y minus Z. Similarly, they got, you know, log B is equal to um, Z minus X, K into minus X, and log C is equal to K into uh, X minus Y, most probably, right? Yeah, so in the next line, third line, what they did, here x is missing, right? So they multiplied x on both the sides. x log a plus here y is missing. So they have taken y log b plus here z is missing. So z log c, okay? So with log a, if you multiply x, then what you are supposed to get? xy minus zx, correct? Then there is plus, so you put plus, then log b. Log b is this one, you are multiplying y with it. So y will be multiplied with this, so it will be yz minus xy. This k I have taken common at once, okay? I'm writing everything inside the bracket, so this k is already there for everyone. Then plus z log c. Log c is this one, you have to multiply z with it. So zx minus yz. Understood? Now, cancel, everything is cancelled, right? So this side will become zero. Clear? Yes, sir. Okay, so if you understood till example 29, inshallah, you will be able to solve, um, at least try to solve, okay? I know in many of you, uh, them you might face problem. Now, uh, question number seven. Six we completed today, right? Of exercise. So in exercise, problem number seven. Try to do it, inshallah. Okay. So exercise nine point two, problem number seven. There are, I guess, eight problem in question number seven. Try to do them, inshallah. If you face any doubt, we will solve it or discuss about it in the following class. Okay. Thank you very much. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.